The survivability of a submarine at extreme depths is a complex and nuanced subject, influenced by a myriad of factors including hull design, construction materials, and operational conditions. While submarines are capable of diving to impressive depths, there are practical limits to how deep they can safely operate without risking catastrophic failure. One commonly cited metric for assessing a submarine's maximum depth capability is its test depth, which represents the depth at which the vessel can safely operate under normal conditions without experiencing structural damage or compromise. For example, the test depth of a U.S. Los Angeles-class submarine is approximately 450 meters 1,500 feet, as indicated by the latest open literature. However, it's important to note that the test depth is not necessarily the absolute maximum depth at which a submarine can survive. Instead, it serves as a conservative estimate based on rigorous testing and analysis conducted during the submarine's design and development phase. In reality, submarines are often capable of diving to depths beyond their test depth, albeit with increased risk and reduced safety margins. As a general rule of thumb, it's widely accepted that the maximum depth at which a submarine can survive, i.e., the depth of implosion or collapse, is typically around 1.5 to 2 times deeper than its test depth. For a Los Angeles-class submarine, this would suggest a maximum depth range of approximately 675 to 900 meters, 2,250 to 3,000 feet under ideal conditions. However, it's important to emphasize that operating a submarine at such extreme depths carries inherent risks and dangers. The immense pressure exerted by the surrounding water can place tremendous strain on the submarine's hull and systems, increasing the likelihood of structural failure, equipment malfunction, or catastrophic collapse. Furthermore, factors such as hull fatigue, material degradation, and operational stress can further compromise the submarine's integrity and seaworthiness, necessitating careful monitoring and maintenance to ensure safe and reliable operation at all times. In summary, while submarines are capable of diving to impressive depths, there are practical limits to how deep they can safely operate without risking catastrophic failure. Understanding and respecting these limits is essential for ensuring the safety and survivability of both the vessel and its crew in the challenging and unforgiving environment of the deep ocean.